<laughs> okay, we should be live. What's up, everybody? If you guys can go into the 90 Day Challenge group um, and see if we are coming up live. I'm here with John Alfredson, and we're actually coming live inside of the Ecom Incubator class, so this should be pretty fun. In fact, I wonder if I could do this and see. Say what's up, everybody. <laughs> yeah, the after lunch. That's an after lunch applause right there. <laughs> we just got done eating lunch. Lunch, everybody's a little excited. So, um, <laughs> we are in data mode. So listen, we're coming live from uh, the Ecom Incubator because we're going to do a quick training on um, Instagram. We're going to do some viral videos, and the only way we could really do it was using this software, Mimo Live. So what we're going to do real quick is we're going to walk through. I'm going to, for the first time ever, try to share my phone and um, walk through a couple things. One, we're going to talk about how to create your own... Uh, custom newsfeed of Instagram ads. Number two, how to uh, get more ads shown to you. As an advertiser, you want ads shown to you. And then I'll show you kind of the copy and everything. You guys are gonna love this. It's like a gold mine of great ideas that you can use to, uh, to sell thousands of units uh, on your own, on your own store. So let's see if this works. I wanna see if this works. So we're gonna share it, hold on. Let's see. I don't know if we can. So we should be, tell me right now if it's showing up on your screen. Can you guys see it on your screen? Yes. It should be like some, I should be, can you guys see me scrolling? Okay, so it's about a 30 second delay. Okay, so we'll keep that in mind as I'm going. Okay, so what you're seeing here is um, a saved, this is basically a bunch of saved items for me on Instagram. These are a bunch of saved posts. So. I'm gonna teach you how to create your own save post, but what these are is these are all ads. Okay, so as you can see, yeah, there's just tons and tons and tons and tons of saved ads of great products to sell. So let's kind of walk through some of these and I'll start showing you some as we go. So here's an example, I'll click on one real quick. And this is an example, as you can see, it's from uh, Nonaqua Worldwide, it's sponsored. And you see there's a video here. Okay, now this should be able to show up. So as you can see, this is uh, some protective nanotechnology for your clothes and footwear that you basically can just spray on and then you put it on and then anything drips off. There's mustard dripping off, there's all kinds of stuff. And it just drips right off your shoes and there's all kinds of ingredients and then if there's anything left, you literally can just wash it right off. So it makes it so you can keep your clothes clean. There it is going off, a, there's chocolate fudge and stuff going off of a t-shirt, mustard going off of a t-shirt, soda going off of a t-shirt. So this is an example of a viral video, okay? You see it just scrolls here in your newsfeed. This video here has done 2.5 million views. Um, it's got the description. Um, I kind of can open it up. Let's take a look at this one as an example. The protective nanotechnology for your clothes and footwear is now available. Now look, and they're using check marks as emojis to get your attention. The spray provides protection against mud, water, snow, Produced according to CEN standards, safe for humans, the environment, does not affect the appearance of clothes and footwear, odorless and colorless. So what they're doing is they're overcoming a lot of objections. They're giving you details about it all. Uh, it works for two to three months after treatment. Place your order at the official website. They have a link. Press like and tell your friends about this new one. And then they have 1,811 comments. So um, they also have a shop now button. So you can see there the shop now button. So if you click the shop now button, it's gonna take you um, outside of Instagram and it's gonna take you into their store. Hold on, it's loading in the background. I'm on the Wi-Fi here. Um, it's asking me what language I wanna choose. So there's the store. And I'm in mobile view right now sharing. So it takes you to the store and it gives you the, the link to be able to buy the product. So just like this, um, you know, it's got kinda of like, it's, this is like a product sales page. Okay, pretty cool. Um, there it is, they got like a promo and stuff like that. So that's an example. What they do is they're basically using a viral video to show this. So let's keep going and let's look at more. Okay, here is a, um, it's like a sticky pad, a gel pad video that shows how you can use these gel pads and you can stick any items to them, okay? So you can stick like your iPad up, you can stick your phone, you can stick um, really anything. It's these little gel pads that hold your products in place. You just get them wet, they're cleanable. So these are products that sell well for a video. You know, you could basically use stuff, stick your phone to it in your car. You can see all kinds of stuff um, as it's playing. So again, using a video to kind of tell a story and be able to keep things sell. Like you see they're driving really fast and they got their, their mug stuck to their car. So let's read the description here. 
having second thought. People are getting crazy about this now. Get it with an additional discount, gel pad five, free shipping only today. Tag and share a friend who would like this. Um, and this, this is like, they got a bad comment there. That's pretty funny. This story uses some, some marketing tactics. This is called a retargeting ad. Um, I saw this from retargeting. So in a minute, I'm going to show you how to create your own custom newsfeed and how I did this. But this is nice. I want to see ads like this. I want to see videos. I want to see what people are using. And I want to see what happens when you click the link to go buy it. I want to see what the store looks like. So here it is. You know, phone boot BB, massive clearance sale, free worldwide shipping. They show the product. I want to see the images that they, that they use. I want to see all this stuff. I want to learn from people that are advertising. I want to, I want to learn from them all. You know, the sticky gel pad, um, $10 compared to 34, 34. hurry, uh, countdown timer. You can get the round or the, tr or the triangle or transparent, choose your quantity and go. And then they got a discount here. If you buy, buy one, buy two, buy three, buy five, you can get um, a discount, 100% money back guarantee. So now you're seeing some copywriting that you can model after, fast delivery, 99.3% reviews. You see a nice description with some bold text in here. Um, you know, it's really, it's really, you learn a lot. You learn, okay, what kind of, what are they using? Product specifications, then they have their guarantee, and then they have their trusted authority, like VeriSign, um, you know, all kinds of stuff. Then they have similar products underneath that. So you start to learn. Then they have reviews. So I like, I like to learn from sites like this, and it all comes down to finding it. So let's look at a few more viral videos, then I'll show you how to create a custom newsfeed. Okay, here's one uh, by Tinkercrate. Um, you know, launch your own, um, you know, it's a subscription, like a Tinker subscription to be able to give kids cool stuff. Here's fidget spinners. These are really popular right now. Gadget Rocks. This is a fidget spinner that does um, like, a, like you could do like a kind of like a trick. It requires a little extra equipment, but you can kind of do a trick. See, this trick needs special equipment. Um, but you can do this and you can kind of do like a, it's a fidget spinner. You can spin it. You can do some magic tricks. It's really cool. Um, this video has had 1.8 million views. Let's look at the description and everything here. Oh my God, I need this. And it has an emoji. This trending hand spinner helps ADHD, anxiety, work focus, 50% off. Click here, tag a friend who needs one. Um, and then you can basically go to the shop now button and you can see how they're, how they're choosing to sell it. So in this case, you know, they've got, um, in this case, they've got their, their images of it. They've got a bunch of different images. You can kind of go scroll through all the images and look at them all. Um, let's see what else they got. They got the price, $34.95, used to be $89.95. Um, hurry, and then they've got a uh, bundle. You can bundle it with some other products. And then they've got like a five-star rating. And then they've got descriptions. You get to see like how people are marketing. So you kind of go through and you could look. Because of the very high demand, please allow two to four weeks for delivery. They, people that put that, that usually is like a sign that they are drop shipping from AliExpress. Two to four weeks for delivery usually means coming from an international warehouse. So this is something you could all do as well. Now, when you're also inside these stores and you see how they're advertising, you could also learn by modeling after their advertising as well. You can see all these other fidgets, fidget uh, pens, um, hand spinner collection, all kinds of fidget toys, fidget cubes, fidgets, so you can see. Um, and then you, they even give you clues as to how to advertise. So you can see like who they're targeting. You know, they're targeting, in their ad here, they're targeting people that have uh, ADHD, anxiety, focus issues. So there's like actual things you can look into for your ads. So it's pretty cool. So again, you're looking for products that sell on cool videos. Here's another one. This product here uh, cuts beer bottles and turns them into glass cups. It's a pretty cool little concept. You could have, you could turn all your old beer bottles into cups, um, into candles, into stuff like that. It cuts it really smooth. Um, pretty cool. 1.1 million views on that one. Same kind of thing. You know, turn disca dis discarded bottles into beautiful, unique glassware and art you won't find anywhere else. Order here. 600 comments. Okay, what about this one? Here's another one. Modern technology. Um, was your car made in 1996 or later? If the answer is yes, see how plugging this tiny little device into your car can save you thousands in unnecessary auto repairs. So what happens is you basically put this device in your car and then it has a mobile app and it'll tell you what's wrong with your car. So basically the same kind of stuff you normally have to go get checked out. This tool will help do this. It'll give you um, notifications uh, on your app and stuff like that. So here's a video of a guy showing it in action. 
It's a nice little tool that you could just basically pop into your car, get the app, and so this kind of video really really sells it. Okay, um, the snowboarding tool here is a blow up um, like a blow up air couch, so like a little mattress you could put out at festivals and events and stuff like that. So you can learn a lot about this. This video here has six mil six point seven million views. Yeah, sold off the hook. Millions of dollars this. So you can see like basically they're showing it in action. They're showing people getting excited about it. And then look at their copy though. I always like looking at the copy. That's what I learned a lot from. We manufactured too many. 71% off until sold out. Get yours here. They've got the, uh, the link. Tag or share with someone who would love this. 8,850 uh, comments. And you know they're not doing a good job managing their comments. These people say it's a scam because you refresh and the counter, the countdown timer starts over. But you can easily manage those. Um, yeah, I question. I say John's uh, little script will take care of that one. This is a scam. And yep. Those, yep. Those posts, so. There's ways to be able to manage that a lot better. So here's the actual product: the Hangout Sofa, thirty-four ninety-seven compared to one hundred twenty dollars. You could choose, you know. Um, a color, whatever kind of color you want, uh, pink if you want it. Buy it now, hurry, left in stock, you have one hour, 59 minutes. Um, the most innovative product of the year. You look at like everything that they are, use it anywhere, they're using a graphic there. Uh, Real-time visitors on the sites, they have some uh, social proof that a lot of people are here right now. Um, and so you kind of can start to see how these people, and, it, and then if you like a store that you come across, you could always go to the main categories in the store uh, the gadget shop. So let's look at this. It's called the gadget snob, the gadget snob, and you can kind of see like what theme they're using, what are their top things. Look, they're use they're selling fidget spinners as well. Um, they're selling tactical backpacks, tech products, um, and then their best sellers. And you can start to kind of like just go through and look and get ideas based on what people that are actually out there advertising. Emergency pocket chainsaw. Um, Hyperspeed charging cable, charge up to five times as fast. Um, the amazing anti-gravity case, really kind of cool stuff here. Shockproof underwater diving case, selfie sticks, um, all kinds of stuff. So you start to like see some of the popular products. So that's why I like Instagram. Instagram, you can go, you can go, you can reverse engineer. You can see a very popular video that has 6.7 million views, and instantly. You can learn um, about ad copy. You can learn about um, what products they have on their store, what else they're doing. Pretty cool. Let's see, 37,000 there, struggling some watches. Let's go through and let's find a couple more products. Um, okay, here's, here's a video that's interesting. This video is showing from production all the way to delivery to a home of their mattress, kind of giving you an inside look. This video here is showing you a head mount display <coughs> Um, for your phone. This video here, <coughs> high speed magne charging magnetic cable. Okay, here's a good one. So let's watch this video. As you watch this video, you can start to see, you know, they basically, um, it's really easy to connect. You connect a little piece to your phone, it pops right in, and now next thing you know, you can even hold it, and that's how strong it is. So you see, it shows how hard it is plugging things in. This solves that problem. So what happens is, as long as you make these videos 59 seconds or less, then what you can do is you can actually, um, you, can, you can essentially get somebody emotionally and impulsively excited about products. You know, this, product, this view here has 20,000 views, but I've seen it with like millions of views. You can get somebody excited. Let's look at the copy here. iPhone 6, magnet cable, only limited time. Get yours here. Then if you click on it, you can see this person's store. This person only has 20,000 views, so they probably haven't advertised a lot. But you see the, the title there, Original Mag Magnetic Phone Cable. And then there's the cable, there's a bunch of pictures. Um, $9.99, so see that's where price is of value to them. It's $9.99 compared to $29.99. They've got a low price, it seems, seems good. You choose iPhone or Andro Android, and then you choose the color. And then they have a nice big add to cart. Hurry, only six left in stock. That number starts going down. A countdown timer, then you got a description. You can look and see what they're doing, and you can model after stuff like this, okay? So I love going through. Let's see if we find a couple more. Um, here's an example of a static image that has uh, words changing on it. That's another really good kind of an ad. So this shows the, 
variety of hats that are available. So they take and they're targeting people in Arizona. That's how I saw it. And then they're targeting like you could actually have like your last name on it or anything on it. That's pretty cool. Uh oh, some of you might have to close your eyes for this one. This is a blackhead remover. Um, this might be a little gross. Uh, yeah, so here's a blackhead remover, and it's a it's it's a tool that that you can use to. Uh, it's kind of making me sick watching it, but it's a tool you can use to uh, to get rid of blackheads yourself, um, and. It's really inexpensive. Of a t- I know I had to stop watching it. I was getting a little, uh, I started getting woozy and st- I was about to pass out. It's like, they go, I, I wake up, like, what happened? You were watching a video of blackhead removal. <laughs> you went black. You went dark. It's true, though, once you get hooked on it. Oh, my God. <laughs> 257,000 views, um, you know, and, and so it's pretty cool. You can kind of learn all about it. Okay, so here's some glasses. So you see, I've got a custom news feed of ads. Here's a subscription box. Um, here is a uh, tool that will help you um, track your technology and your keys and all kinds of stuff, a tracker. Um, this device turns your iPhone into an Android. So here's a video turning your, your iPhone into an Android. Finally. We need to turn uh, Androids into iPhones is what we need to do, though. Um, more subscription boxes. Here is a, um, a cool little rock that can hide like an engagement ring. It's kind of a cool little idea. Um, here's some jewelry targeting like basketball. Um, okay, here's some cake nozzles. I think we'll, st- we'll show this one for a second. So you guys ever see those like little recipe videos that are like 59 seconds or less te- teaching you how to do like a recipe? These, these things, next time you see these little viral videos, you should be thinking, what product could I sell with something like this? Because right here, like something like this with, with cake tips, you could sell cake tips, you know, these cake decorating tips. You can sell these tips that make flowers or make different designs. Um, this video here has had 1.5 million views. Um, if you bake with love, you will love these Happy Bake nozzles. 50% off today, free worldwide shipping. Um, pretty cool. How about this one? Here's a, here's a zipper that um, bloggers are calling a lifesaver. Meet the easy zipper. Here's a zipper that fixes broken zippers. Um, it's pretty cool. A video sells this very, very well. So it says you just clip off your old zipper and use this new zipper. This new zipper solves the problems that you're facing. And it shows how simple and easy it is, this new zipper. So anybody likes to travel and stuff like that, they watch this video and this video sells them. It shows like this little part right there where they fix a broken zip. Boom. Really simple. Um, one million views on that one. You know, and they give you the link to order. On sale today, fix your broken jeans, your favorite bag, or even your tent with the zipper fixer. So pretty cool being able to look and being able to reverse engineer. Um, I know everybody here is like, I need that actually. My zipper's broken right now. Um, face masks, uh, teeth stuff. Peel off your eyebrow. It's a, it's like a tattoo that peels off your eyebrows. I don't know. 143,000 views though. Um, <laughs> This is silver hair design is blowing up in popularity. Here's a simple washout formula that you can have to make your hair silver. I guess it's like a trending popular thing to kind of have silver highlights in your hair. Yes. Is it? Oh, all, all the people here with gray hair are like, yes. <laughs> yes, this is, these are highlights, you guys. These are highlights. That's all these are. They're highlights. And I heard balding is next thing that's in fashion. So... <laughs> Anyways, it's, it's appealing. It's, a, it's appealing. It can sell. The videos sell it. Here's the shower experience. Um, you know, showing a nozzle and works. Um, another bed. Let's see. Okay, here's a good one. Um, get the most out of your pineapples. The pineapple slicer will peel, core, and slice a fresh pineapple in 30 seconds. On sale plus free shipping. Buy it here. So it's very, very simple. It's just a nice little tool. You just pop it in a pineapple, and 30 seconds later, you've got it in perfect swirl. So it sells really well off video. Cut the stem off. It's showing the instructions. Cut the stem off, and then you twist the slicer in there, and then um, basically and you pull it out. It's funny because that is available at every single grocery store in the universe mm-hmm. right now, but, but showing it on this video makes all the difference. It doesn't sell well off the page. Great, Great example. So this product is for sale it's not like it's not like pe- people don't know because when you see it in a package it just says like pineapple slicer yeah. 
But when you see it in a video, especially with a comedic guy, and especially with these jump cuts, it's like it makes it even faster. Just twist, then peel, then pull. It's like, oh, that fast? So that's why it's got one million views. And they got some emojis, some fire emojis. Buy it here. And you, you can really kind of go in and reverse engineer. So you kind of go into the site here. This site is furymix.com, passion one-stop shop. And there you got their pictures of it. They've got the product. They've got the price. Add to cart. Hurry up. Sale ending. Free shipping plus on sale. Click add to cart. Um, limited three items only per person. That puts a little scarcity in it. Perfect slice every time. They've got a good description. Check out our new best selling tool, watermelon cutter. So now you, you sit here and you go, oh, I just saw that product. Now let me go over here and let's look at the watermelon cutter. And again, this is probably sold in every store too, but look at it. Look at the picture. Wouldn't that be so much more exciting if there was a video that showed it in action that was a little jump cut video and you could probably easily find a video on YouTube. It just looks so boring without one. Or, or, make, one that. or make one yourself, yeah. Like if you guys have like a, a child age 15 or 13 or something like that, I bet they would be like, hey, how would you like to make a viral video? I bet they'd be all over it and they would love it and make it like a little, uh, arts and crafts project with your kid. Let's make viral videos with, with cooking products. Real, real fun stuff, they would love it. So, you know, just, you can order this stuff. You can even probably order a similar one on Amazon, get it in two days, make a video, and then sell it and drop ship it from AliExpress. So it would just be so much better if it showed it as a video. So that's, you can kind of go to this person's site. Now that you're on their site, you can actually go to all their products and you can start seeing all the stuff they're selling. You know, as seen on TV products, the baby banana toothbrush, you know, fidget cubes. You notice fidget cubes are all the, all the rage right now. Everybody's capitalizing on those. Here's the baby banana uh, toothbrush. You know, babies love bananas and uh, you got to get them to brush their teeth somehow. So make them think they're eating a banana, you know, I guess is the way to do it. So you kind of can start learning all about sites. This is how I do all my reverse engineering. It's all about finding really good, really good products. So here's another example. Phone BB has, um, here's, a, here's a credit card case that, that's like a little wallet, but it's RFID protection. So it's, it, people can't use, uh, if you're worried about people being able to hijack your information, um, that's covered. And you can, have, you can get an engraved one, 2.5 million views. And it basically, let's look at the description. Okay, here we go. The cascading wallet is the most fun and secure wallet available. Get yours now. Share and tag someone for the good news. Notice they're using emojis, stuff like this. And then click shop now. And you can start to see same same old site we're all using. This is the basic themes. Um, cascading wallet, $14. Hurry, running out of time. Choose your stuff. You notice the same stuff we just looked at. You can start to really model after a site like this. And you'll notice they're advertising and that's what you want to do. You want to, you want to basically go, let me see if I can show you a couple more. Okay, here's, um, for men, this holds your shirts in place. Hopefully you guys know that's what we're watching right now because I guess if I didn't prep that, it looks kind of, you don't know what we're watching. That got pretty close. So it holds your shirt in place. Um, holds your shirt in place is what it does. It's actually a creative little, little technique. You know, I showed this to, to somebody and they thought, well, that's actually a really great idea. You know, so you bent, you know, if you're moving around a bunch, you're, you, it stays in place. So do your dress shirts. Everything old is new again. <laughs> it is like a male guard belt. It's, it's suspenders. It's essentially suspenders. Yeah. And it's just, it's a, it's a creative idea. Again, this would not sell if it were a picture. You guys gotta understand, this, these are products that do not sell well as pictures, but they sell great as uh, videos. Okay, um, do your dress shirts always come loose, leaving you looking like a slob? Keep your shirts perfectly tucked in with these hidden suspenders, okay? Um, let's see, what else we got here? Okay, another magnetic charger, another magnetic charger. Okay, this one has 2.2 million views. Detachable magnetic snap iPhone cable will easily snap in place with the yank resistant features now 84% off, less than $10. So you see, going back to their store, I think we already went to this one earlier. Yep, we already went to this one earlier, and look at that, $9.99. They're killing it with this. Look at that, 2.2 million views. 
More blackhead stuff. Okay, here's a peel mask. Again, same site. So this one's from Gadget Rocks. You'll notice I'm getting a lot of ads from the same people. And I'll explain to you what to do here and how to be able to get those. Um, and I think that might be it now. Okay. So how do you create your own custom news feed like this? Okay. Um, what you do is, first things first, you go to um, your regular news feed on Instagram. So here I am. I'm on my Instagram news feed. Okay. This is all you got to do. You go to your Instagram news feed and you start scrolling through. You see stuff from friends. So who's this from? This is from my friend here. Successful people versus unsuccessful people. Um, here's somebody here eating. People post pictures of food. Uh, here's somebody hiking. You know, here's some Scottsdale area residents. Um, a lean down challenge. So this is an ad. See how it says sponsored? I'm being targeted because I live in Scottsdale and maybe I liked something fitness related. And um, this girl's hyping me up to be part of a six week lean down challenge. Maybe she, not she noticed I needed to get lean. She's targeting me. Um, but she's targeting my area. That's pretty spot on. And then you got more posts from friends. Good day. People posting with their dogs. You're posting pictures. More dogs. Instagram's filled with dogs. More, more dogs. I mostly just see dogs on Instagram, I guess. People are posting. And then you got another ad, Mobile Strike. Now, Mobile Strike is a huge company, so they probably just advertise to the world. Um, and of course, it's just girls pillow fighting, which has nothing to do with Mobile Strike. Oh, then she's going to launch the app, and then it, then it does have to do with Mobile Strike. But Mobile Strike probably felt like girls pillow fighting would get guys' attention. Um, more pictures, more pictures. I know there's like a 30-second delay. I'm going to go down. I'm going to keep going, and I'm going to show you an example. As these sponsored ads comes up, I'm going to show you what to do. Okay, I'm at another sponsored ad now. This one's from Ty Lopez. Um, get free training on the profession that's made more millionaires than anything else. So he's obviously targeting my entrepreneur-related keywords there. And then I'm going to keep going. So as you're scrolling through your newsfeed, there's regular posts from friends, and then there's posts that have the word sponsored. The word sponsored is going to come right underneath their username. So right here, here's Tony Robbins. It says sponsored right underneath the username, and it says Tony Robbins Live Business Mastery. He's promoting an event in Las Vegas, probably targeting entrepreneurs near the area or whatever it might be. Um, let me scroll down even further. So what I'm doing is I'm looking for these uh, sponsored ads. Okay, here's another one. Ad hoc, a personal assistant for your digital advertising so they know that I'm into Facebook advertising. So you see, all of these ads that will keep coming are basically, um, I want them. We used to hate advertising, but now that we're in advertising, we like it. So here's uh, Workplace by Facebook, sponsored. I guess it's an app or something like that. I just keep scrolling through and I see these ads. So now, next time you're on Instagram, we're going to show you what to do with these. So I just want to make sure you understand how to see them. Here's Cirque de Soleil, sponsored, um, probably because I visited their website uh, recently because I was in Vegas and wanted to see a show, which, by the way, I saw Absinthe. And if you can handle the foul language, it's a really great show. Uh, let's okay. Here's another one sponsored. Here's a local social media company. Let's bloom. Um, they're local here in Scottsdale, so I'm seeing an ad from retargeting from them. So you'll notice I'm about every ten, every ten posts is an ad. Here's Millionaire Mentor, Jason Stone sponsoring probably because I uh, visited his website. So how can you get it so that you're targeted this much? Okay, I'm gonna kind of show you guys a little secret here. Okay, and then here's Flixel Photos sponsored. It's not even every 10. It's like less than every 10. Um, I'm going to count the next one actually so I can show you. You want this. Okay, let's see what else I got. Sponsored. Okay, let's stop on this one. The flex belt. Does it really work? Yes, my abs are crazy sore. Get 30% off now. Showing somebody with abs wearing a belt. The flex belt. Does it really work? Yes. And then let's, there's an ad, right? Now, it doesn't have a lot of engagement. doesn't mean it's not selling. They might be trying an ad. Click it. And let's see what happens. It goes to a big, long sales page for this flex belt. Big, 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 long sales page selling all that kind of stuff. Boom. Order now. And they want me to buy it. Okay. So when you see an ad, next time you guys see an ad, I want you to stop. Okay. Um, click this little, uh, when you're on here, I want you to basically, um, when you see posts, Okay, let me go to another one actually because that one didn't have it. When you see posts, I don't know if I scrolled too fast, too fast right here. Okay, life size HD. Okay, when you see posts that are sponsored, on the bottom right hand side, you'll see this little um, ribbon looking bookmark. Okay, 
when you tap it once, I just tapped it, it went dark. That means that you're favoriting it. But here's what I want you all to do. On Instagram, when you tap it and hold it, it's going to bring up a new thing. Dang, you're not able to see it really on the screen. Is it cut off a little bit? Uh, it it's going to be cut off. I'm trying to share this really zoomed in. There's no way I'm going to be able to share it. Don't worry. Here, I'm just going to explain what it's going to say. When you tap and hold that, it's going to ask you where you want to save it to. You're going to create a new folder, a new bookmark folder called ads or sponsored. And then you're going to save it inside your ads. So that's what I just did. I just saved it inside my ads. Okay, let's see if I could try this again and find another one. I can, I'm going to try in a minute to figure out how to get it so it's not cut off for you. I'm seeing that it's cut off. So here's a um, butter elixir is a, um, I don't know what this thing is. Their targeting is off. This is not my, not my <laughs> ideal deal. Butter. Why would I want butter elixir lip thing? Example of bad targeting, guys. I'm off this. Let's see. Probably because I did a post where I was born in a teepee. And I'm targeting people that like live in teepees for that. Let's see. Okay, here's another one. Finally, a classy, elegant, and cost-effective way to stay on top of your client stuff. Okay, it says magazines. So every time you go through, now I know you guys might be thinking, Chris, I don't have time to scroll through the newsfeed all day. Well, you don't have to do it all day, but you really should. You should get to a point where, you, where you're finding all these ads. So when you click on this little sponsor thing, it's not going to happen. You're not going to see it. When you click on it, it's going to favorite it. But when you click and hold on it, it favorites it and it brings up this little save to box. You create a folder and then save all your ads or all your sponsored into one folder. Now that's how you're going to create a custom news feed of all your sponsored activities. You guys should be doing this on your phone, following along. Okay, here's like an internet marketing webinar. Maybe I like the picture. So if you ever see anything, um, if you ever see anything, then that's what you want to do. You want to basically um, save it. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to show you guys that. Before I show you that one little piece, I'm going to give you a little shiny object uh, syndrome. It was brought to my attention by one of our entrepreneurs just before this, that this picture was going viral here of this girl in this bathing suit. And um, tell me when you guys are there in the room, the girl in the bathing suit, red bathing suit. Okay. The girl in the red bathing suit uh, is going viral today, so I might as well show this. It'll be a quick little distraction, then I'll show you more how to build the custom news feed. So this right here is a viral campaign run by a company called Sunny Co. Clothing. Um, watch this. You guys want to trip out. This is, this is just shown to me from the entrepreneurs before. Okay, Sunny Co. Clothing. Remember how many likes it had before this talk? 580,000. How many likes? How many followers do they have now? 720,000. Seven, where were they at when you showed me? So at like 11 a.m. this morning, they had, 200, morning, they had 270,000 followers. Now they have 720,000 followers. Is anybody interested in hearing how they got 500,000 followers today? Yes. So it is a shiny object compared to what we were just talking about, but we, <laughs> but we stumbled across them. Hey, you guys brought it to my attention. And I saw it. And you know how I am with shiny objects. I'm like a little squirrel. <laughs> so what they did was they, they basically made a post. Um, they made a post. Their post is this girl here in the red uh, bikini. Okay, a basic post. This post was made. Um, and look at this post. It's liked by 288,000 people. It says, sharing is caring. Everyone that reposts and tags us in this picture within the next 24 hours will receive a free Pamela Sunny suit. Offer only valid in the USA. Promo ends 5 3 at 3 p.m., which is today at uh, 3 p.m. Must pay shipping and handling. You see that? <laughs> so you're saying there's a catch. This promotion is sponsored by Twazer app. Yeah, yeah, you're already starting to see it on your news feed? No, but it's my, my cousin shared yeah, the yeah. post. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Nice, yeah. Yeah, people are sharing the post. Why not? You're going to get a free Pamela Sunny suit. Just pay shipping and handling. <laughs> it's just a couple kids here in uh, Arizona, ASU, right? Just a couple students here in ASU that, are, that don't know what they're doing. You go look them up on Facebook, they're like, huh? Yeah, they're like, we need a trademark lawyer. We need a... Okay, after 24 hours, everyone who reposted and tagged us will be receiving a code and they'll be able to use it. So they haven't even given the code. They said, just share this. 
And they probably like weren't expecting this many. Okay. Yeah, they weren't expecting it to go so viral. So 111,000 comments, and they haven't even they haven't even uh, given out coupon codes yet till tomorrow. So did they use the Twazer app to do? This promotion is sponsored by Twazer app. Probably they probably like Twazer app. Probably is running a viral campaign. I don't know enough about this. It was just brought to my attention since this is live and in real time. I haven't had time to investigate. I was busy eating mac and cheese. But, um, but I will tell you what probably happened. If you, if you, my guess is that they probably um, used some influencers to, to start the sharing. So if the sharing starts from influencers with a big following, then it's more believable that this thing is real. Once people believe it's real, it's like, it's, it's a free activity. Share this. It's a free activity. Why not? Just for a chance to get, even if they don't, even if the shipping and handling is too expensive, how hard was it for them to share? It wasn't hard at all, right? But Twazer app is the easiest way to buy and sell anything with other students on campus. Yeah. College campus trading. Yeah, it's like a little college campus trading thing they have. So it's. It's pretty simple. This thing's going crazy viral, but you know what? If anything, did we just learn something that a free plus shipping offer with the right viral campaign could potentially get you 500,000 followers overnight? Although, you probably need a girl in a bikini and Twazer app. <laughs> Anyways, that was just a, a, a shiny object. Yeah, I mean, I think there's a website. If you go to um, Sunny Co. Clothing and you go to their website... I think they have, um, they've got like a Shopify store. Featured products, you guys recognize this all? Featured products, They're, they've got their bathing suits. See, so they have a high perceived value with all these bathing suits too, 100 bucks. So here's the Pamela Sunny suit, I think that's the one that they said. That's the one that's in the picture. Pamela Sunny suit, normally 64.99, and they're gonna get a coupon for, for it with shipping, whatever. They probably didn't think it was gonna be that many people or whatever, but, um, I'm sure they're going viral. So if this, if this, if even if they were just breaking even on this, that campaign would be worth it. You're telling people just pay shipping, and actually they could be charging 19.95 shipping. You know, so if this was their base cost, they could actually pull it off. I don't know if they have that much inventory, but um, it's a pretty basic swimsuit. They could just release it. So it's pretty cool how they did this. It's an example of a uh, of a viral campaign. They're probably building a big mailing list, huge retargeting list, all kinds of stuff. Or so. Totally scaring the hell out of them. Right there, it's probably scaring the hell out of them. This this thing is clearly going viral very, very fast. You'll get a phone call soon. <laughs> yeah. So everybody go post the go reshare this. So you get a free uh, free suit. Just pay shipping. Yeah. So okay, so let's let's jump on over and let's um, let's jump over and let's talk real quick about um, let's see if we can switch this. Let's let's go talk for a minute about uh, let's jump in the ninety eight challenge. Let's Share for one minute about um, how to do that, and then we'll wrap this talk up. So, when you go to these Shopify stores, like uh, like that one that we just went to, like Phone BB or any one of these, when you go to these stores, um, you're now going to be retargeted. So, one of the things that I love doing, okay, is I love visiting these popular sites, like like Phone BB. I love visiting all these popular sites because I want to be retargeted. I want these people to retarget me. So if you know that somebody's spending a lot of money in advertising, if you see a video that does like a million views or something like that, click the link. You want to be retargeted. Don't you want to get their ad copy? Don't you want to see the viral videos they're using? Don't you want to see how they make a custom picture? So you can say, bingo, they're spending a million dollars on advertising and I'd rather learn from them than have to figure it out myself. You want to be advertised to. Since you want to be advertised to, come here, and not only that, but come here and click on some products. Like fidget cubes, you wanna start getting advertised by fidget cubes, there you go, click on these. Now I'm on this page and I'm actually like, I'm gonna get retargeted with fidget cube ads, you know? So like, you want to go and you want to see these. So when you're on Instagram or you're on Facebook and you see sponsored ads, you should click on them. That's my main point here, click on them. You want to be, you want to be retargeted. You want to be retargeted by popular sites if you can. So go find very popular big Shopify stores. Get retargeted by them. If somebody's spending money on advertising, you want them to spend it advertising you. Then make a saved bookmark list of all of these things and start doing it. Trust me, this is, this is how I'm learning so much. A lot of people go, Chris, how, how are you learning so quickly? Like how, how are you 
instantly like learning all of this kind of stuff and it's like well I'm visiting all these sites and the next thing you know they're all they're all retargeting me like here was another site that I just visited uh, by decals dot com I think it was with a K yeah so here's another one by decals I just got retargeted by these guys I just looked at a like like an ad and I love this stuff I love looking at people's Shopify stores I want to see how do they name their products how do they price their products what are what um, you know what kind of products do they sell? You know, right here, there's a lot of print on demand here, on this. Okay, so you're you're always looking to be able to reverse engineer people. You you want to. This is what you want to do. You want to go see how are people selling, especially if they have Shopify stores. Okay, that's your main goal. Um, because a lot of times, a lot of times you can see how they're using videos to market stuff like that. Um, you can start to see like how they're even professional companies like the companies that are selling their own brands Like they're selling their own Omniball these people are when they're selling their own brands here Here's a big tip. I can give everybody here. This company is selling their own brand Omniball. Well How if there was a generic Omniball on Aliexpress? What if you treated it as though that product was your own brand? What if you gave it that much emphasis beautiful pictures Beautiful uh, stuff. It's pretty easy to do, and that's what I'm gonna do. That's what I'm gonna do. Like, is I'm gonna I'm gonna start teaching you all how to like treat your products with such high perceived value, even if you're just drop shipping them, that people look at this and go, "Man, this is worth hundreds of dollars." And then you come through, and it's like 19.95, and they go, "Oh my god, this is the most amazing deal ever." I I would have bought it at 49.95, and it's 19.95. That's from perceived value. That's for, that's all you need. Is you need perceived value. And, and that's all that it's gonna take, okay? And we're gonna help you with that, okay? Just like this, 19.95, 20 bucks, whatever it is, okay? 79.95 for that, 20 bucks for the bag. So see the perceived value, 80 bucks, and 20 bucks if you want a bag, nice little upsell, nice little one-click upsell there. So that's what I wanna teach you. So today's lesson, at least the, the, since the screen sharing part's over, today's lesson was on how to be able to save products in your Instagram newsfeed, save ads, how to be able to build a custom newsfeed, how to get retargeted so you start seeing more ads, if you guys see your, your homework assignment, if you see any ad on Instagram that has over a million views or even over 100,000 views, save it. Save it. Start building a custom news feed. Save it. Not only save it, but click on it so you get retargeted. Build yourself a nice, big, long custom news feed. I've got like 100 products in there. And then start reverse engineering. Start going through. It's the best research. Learning from people who are actually spending hundreds of thousands or millions of dollars in advertising is the best research. They'll never share that information with you. Even if I go on a private mastermind with them, they don't want to share that information, but you have it for free right at your fingertips. So that's kind of like what I wanted to, um, what I wanted to share with you there. Okay? So hopefully you guys enjoy that.